Hello, hello, welcome to Apiary Minor. I'm excited today, and I know I say that a lot, but it's partially because I'm just an excited guy. It's also partially because I get myself pretty pumped up for these videos because I'm still a little nervous. But I'm super excited today because look at this. I got my server PSU. Oh. So as I said in a couple videos back, I picked up this PSU off a of parallel miner in a two pack for less than $60. It came with the breakout boards and it came with eight PCIe cables. So I'm stoked. This thing is going to be great. It was a recommendation from Brandon Cohen. Uh, he left an affiliate link in his video. So I will leave that video down in the description so you can use his affiliate link if you want to as well. So essentially what I think is gonna happen here is uh, this is essentially just gonna be plugged right into there and we can just lay those across there. Now. See these guys? Ah, oh, those are long, nice. And they have the adapter on them. These are good, solid, solid cables. So, next step is going to be to come over here and we just wanna get this PSU out of the way. And uh, we're good. Um, I should be able to now just take this new PSU, set her down right here. I'm gonna plug her in on the other side probably in the future, but for now, I have the cord already on this side, so. I should take a couple of these and plug them in, and I don't want you to watch me do all of this, so uh, I think uh, I'm gonna take a little tip, steal it from Hobbyist Miner, who borrowed it from Red Panda Miner, and just go one, a two, a three. Hey, hey, and just like that, it's up and running. Well, at least it's all plugged in. We got these three cables running up, and they have a splitter on them that's going half to the riser and half directly to the card here. So there's where it plugs into the riser there. And I didn't show before, but this breakout board, uh, it has eight PCIe cable slots and one SATA here, it looks like. And I believe this one is so you can link multiple PSUs together. So I could take the two 750s I have, make a 1500, and potentially run eight, eight uh, GPUs all at once. I mean, that's, that's pretty cool. I mean, I, I don't know if it would support it, actually. It's only 1500, maybe I'd need more than that, but I don't know. It's, it can definitely run more than I'm running right now, that's for sure. So I'm gonna try powering it up. It should just be this little on button. Oh, green, 12.3, I like that. 12 is my favorite number. I don't know what that means though, but cool. 12.3 and they are running. Got some color up here. So I'm gonna try if I just, oh, that's still on. Okay, I guess that's still on. Is it? Yep, it is. So motherboard running, booted up once, tried. I think I got my monitor on. You guys, this feels like, I don't know, this feels like it might be the first step and I might be able to actually call myself a miner now. <laughs> no, you know what, You know, I can't call myself a miner until I get this dang motherboard out of the case and I put it on here. Once I have that standalone rig, then I will officially be a miner. That is the deal. But I am, uh, I'm feeling pretty good about this. It's a slow process for me, but I am learning a lot and I am enjoying it. Okay, it looks like it is booting up. We are probably good to go. So, well, I wanted to sign off and just say, hey, thank you so much, you guys. I really appreciate you watching my content so far and those who have subscribed and liked, so appreciated. Uh, I will see you guys on a video again very, very soon. You have a good uh, evening or afternoon or morning, if that's what you're into, if that's what you're doing when you're watching this video. Cheers.